Hello, that is Ben, AI6YR. I'm uh, doing a Summits on the Air activation today. Thought I'd just show you the quick setup. Um, it's actually, uh, I'm on a little unknown hill, which is uh, near a part of Malibu Creek State Park or near it. And uh, it's uh, a Summits on the Air, uh, Whiskey 6, Sierra Charlie 347. And uh, this is the view over here. It's not the highest hill around here, but it works. And this is, uh, just to look around. And I uh, thought I'd show you what my setup is. Uh, it happens to be the January uh, VHF contest, which uh, I decided to head up to this hill while a contest was going on locally, because that way people would be on the local bands. And uh, that's why I have a bunch of different, uh, uh, different uh, handhelds here, because I've got various bands on there. That's uh, a Baofeng, uh, a combination uh, 220 uh, 2 meter radio uh, that is a uh, Yesu FT 818 multi band uh, actually it's all band uh, all modes and that uh, the Yesu FT 60 which is 2 meters 440 and uh, GPS there and uh, anyway so that's the setup um, I did talk to uh, uh, some folks earlier in uh, Toronto and so did a little bit of DX and then talked to a lot of people locally. And so uh, the uh, Yesu FT818, which if you've looked at my other videos, is an all band radio that um, is uh, very portable and it uh, runs six watts if you've got an external power supply. I've actually got a battery hiding in the corner here, uh, which is a Bieno battery uh, just sitting in the bushes here. Uh, and this is, I forget how much this is. This is uh, four and a half uh, amp hours, 12 volts, enough to run this for quite a quite a while, all day actually. And uh, that is kind of the setup. Obviously a backpack and, and all the usual um, wilderness gear. And uh, this is a Garmin GPS, which um, I pulled out of the e-waste pile that somebody had dumped there, and it happens to work. So I'm kind of happy on that score. Uh, and that was just so I could find the exact uh, peak here because there's a big series of uh, hills here and it's kind of hard to tell which one's the highest one for this. So um, anyway, that's a quick uh, look at my soda operation here um, and just making some contacts. I'll try to put some um, contact audio in here. Um, I've got the one for Toronto, but uh, we'll see what else, how the bands do. This is AI6YR. Alpha India 6, uh, Yankee Romeo. We got you in there. We're not, uh, we're a little far, a little ways off you there, but good signal for, for QRB. How are things out in uh, sunny California there? We're in the midst of a snowstorm here at about uh, 24. Alpha India 6, Yankee Romeo, QRP, uh, VE3XYY. Go ahead. Yeah, VE3XYY. Uh, this is AI6YR. Thanks for picking me up. Yeah, things are nice and uh, sunny here. It's actually about, uh, I think about uh, 62 or 63 degrees where I'm standing. I'm standing on top of a, a summits on the air hill, actually. Just uh, uh, thought I'd take a hike and uh, make some contacts. So um, it's, uh, I, I guess, uh, a little warmer than uh, where you are. Uh, back to you. So just a little bit about my antennas. Um, this antenna is the built-in antenna that comes with the Yesu, and that's for two meters and 440. I've actually got a uh, fishing pole, and that's the fishing pole right here, um, which I use as a walking stick for this, and an end-fed wire, which goes all the way down to a box right here. And that gives me all the other bands. And you can see the box there, which I have open. Um, so that, uh, that works pretty well for me, and then there's a uh, ground radio which goes out in that direction someplace, um, which gets me enough, uh, gets me on all the bands. And uh, this is the EARC 9 to 1 Unun, -un, uh, which works pretty well. Um, so I just uh, built that myself, just got to wrap a lot of wires in the right order around a toroid. And um, 
And the biggest problem I've had is my home built uh, box is I tend to lose connections because I'm out on hiking. So I've had to re-solder those wires a few times. I'm hoping this time it'll hold. So that is the antenna box and there's obviously a piece of coax here, which is a tiny little thin piece of coax that goes to the radio. Uh, just for fun, this is the, the Morse code key I've been using. Uh, it's a pretty cheap MFJ um, a Morse code uh, uh, key and I mounted it on an old uh, license plate of mine. So uh, there you go. Alpha, India 6, Yankee Romeo. Alpha, India 6, Yankee Romeo. Boy, we just uh, faded away. Uh, Alpha, India 6, Alpha, India 6, QRZ, uh, K6, CJJ. Alpha India 6, Yellow Romeo, Yellow Romeo, Yellow Romeo. Uh, AI 6, uh, the AI 6 ending in Romeo, absolutely no, call, no copy, no copy at all. Hopefully conditions will prove a little uh, here. Uh, look forward to getting working you again if you can hear me. From King Henry Six, Canada, Japan, Japan. So that's a that's a station in uh, Hawaii who can't quite hear me. They're running a contest. He's probably running some power too, and I'm running only six watts, so that's why he couldn't hear me. Oh well. Your suffix, your suffix. Yankee Romeo, Yankee Romeo. Yankee Romeo, Alpha India Six, Yankee Romeo, Ken, Colorado, Ken, Colorado. Thanks. Name is Ben. Bravo. Echo November. Bravo. Echo November in California. Roger. QSL. Thank you. Thanks. 73.